project that we undertook was really to look at a complex, very, very technical medical problem, which is diagnostic error and improving diagnostic quality, and think about how an issue and a, and a challenge that has historically and most recently been undertaken through the lens of practitioners and healthcare professionals and providers might be flipped around um, to utilize the expertise and experience of healthcare consumers and, and patients themselves in identifying creative uh, solutions to improving diagnostic quality. There can be different types, which is missed diagnosis, something you have that someone didn't see, or simply a misdiagnosis. You think you have uh, a common cold and you actually have the actual flu, and so there are different ways that it can manifest. We looked at using the citizen's jury model to develop and actually bring that expertise of and the, the experience of healthcare providers, clinicians, emergency care, administrators, and those responsible for the regulatory and legal procedures in a healthcare setting, and say, here are the conditions under which your doctors are working. And um, knowing what you know now about learning uh, these background information, these different approaches to how patient and doctor communication, um, how timing is structured within a care environment, um, we put the question to patients themselves of what are the challenges they see uh, that face uh, patients when they go into a clinical setting, what are the opportunities they would see themselves being able to enact in a care setting to say, here are things I can do so that they could improve the quality of, diagnostic, of, of diagnosis in a partnership with a doctor or nurse or, or care provider. In this process, we really looked at re-establishing this partnership in terms of what roles and responsibilities can both patients and providers play in working together to ensure that providers are being clear about what they need to help and support a patient in telling the story about their symptoms and what's happening, and that patients are given the support that they need and guidance they need to help a provider um, have the information that can help them make a more informed decision as a team, no matter how seemingly difficult, technical, and complicated, or even nuanced a challenge can be, there are ways to incorporate public participation and IAP2 principles and values into how you engage with and uh, encounter that issue or dissect and work with and work toward solutions on a problem uh, with individuals that can really allow them to see themselves as part of the solution to it.